Hey everyone, welcome back here. So we're gonna do a quick little video here. This is probably gonna be a little short on the Alchemist Car Care uh, Quick Detailer. It's called Quicksilver. So I was actually just, uh, I was, you know what? I was like, let me use this on the Equinox as I'm drying it with uh, Fine Lab. And I'm not using this as a drying aid per se. I'm actually using it to mop up any residue that may be left behind by Fine Lab. But let me tell you what, Fine Lab version three does not leave heavy residue like, like version one did. Um, so this states that it's anti-static, removes water spots, cleans and shines. Quicksilver is the ultimate quick detailer that is the ultimate quick detailer. The anti-streaking formula adds gloss and it safely removes light to moderate soil and recent water spots, while the anti-static properties leave it cleaner longer. It contains no wax or silicone, non-abrasive and safe on all surfaces, making it perfect for a drying aid, spot washing and waterless washing. And the directions are pretty straightforward. Shake well before use. Apply one to two sprays per panel. Work part with a soft microfiber towel. Turn over and buff surface. Repeat it for the entire vehicle. Do not apply to hot surfaces. And when you get this, you get this little sticker or this little uh, cardboard thing here. And it says, give it a shake before each use. So I will tell you, it's really slick. So I've actually used the, done half the vehicle already with it. And um, I reached out to, oh, geez, I forgot the, the dude's name. Uh, so uh, I forget that uh, I forget his name. Um, with that said, I asked him, "Is this leaving protection behind?" And he says, "That's a good question." Um, and because it, I read in the back, this contains no wax or silicone. I was like, "Okay, this thing's not leaving protection behind." It. And he told me that that is actually true. Now you are are altering the surface tension, and so anytime you're altering surface tension, it means you're leaving something on the surface. Now that's something on the surface, depending on the product, can be durable or cannot be durable. In this instance, it's not durable. All right, so we're gonna alter the surface tension and I can t I already knew immediately when I used it, I was like, this thing um, is not gonna have durable protection in it, just reading, reading that. And sure enough, he, uh, that was confirmed. He says, all you're gonna get is gloss and slickness, and, th and this thing is slick. So it works perfect for like mopping up, you know, doing little touch-ups from here and there from the Fine Lab product there. And again, I can just come over with a secondary towel and just knock off the rest. So uh, it's really nice and slick. And so if you're looking for a product that you can use as a drying aid, maybe you don't want to alter your surface tension. I mean, alter your, your I should say surface tension, your coating properties or your wax properties or your, or your coating properties. Now you might want to give this a shot. It kind of gives me the same vibe as uh, CarPro Echo in terms of slickness. Now gloss is subjective to everybody. This paint already looks good because it's clean and coated. And to be honest, I don't know if that coating is still here. This has the quartz coating. My brother really abused it so because he didn't take care of it. So I don't know if it's still there. I will do a regular wash. Regular a, um, a decon wash. And see how it goes but yeah this stuff's really easy to use like I'm using it over plastic trim glass and it's really 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 slick so it's it kind of gives me the same slickness as that uh, ceramic detailer on amplify and the final detail ceramic detailer uh, amplify but we're not adding durable protection behind. So it's kind of more along the, long, the lines of CarPro Echo diluted at one to 20. Huh, I was wondering what that was, those crows are uh, 
being chased off by some of those smaller birds. Okay, so I'm using two towels. This is a auto fiber royal plush, and then I'm using a FTW pink. Now we went over this this one. Yeah, this car's got some contamination on it. I think that's why I'm not. I could use it's gonna use a good it needs a good decon wash and so that's pretty much it for using um, Quicksilver you can use it on any surface uh, paint glass or uh, trim plastic trim I left the Equinox looking with a real nice gloss actually I'm gonna go ahead and use it on the front glass too while I'm at it while I'm here I'll use it on this piece of glass here. You can see most of it flashes away pretty quick. So that's pretty much it. Let me get rid of these little dirt spots or whatever that is. I'll tell you, my brother let this kind of just sit and it's got a lot of caked on stuff. So. Uh, yeah, it feels pretty slick. So it's actually a really nice product. So that's uh, Quicksilver from Alchemist. I want to give you guys a quick little look at this. I mean, you can tell the gloss looks fantastic from this. So it's going to amplify gloss and slickness, but it's not going to leave durable protection. So yes, it is going to alter your surface tension to a degree, but it's not going to mask your hydrophobic properties from your wax coating or sealant. So maybe this is a product that you're going to consider. For those of you looking for a drying aid that doesn't leave protection behind, um, you can use something like this um, again gives me carpro echo to carpro echo 1 to 20 vibe that's what this is giving me on there so overall real nice product from alchemist and again i want to thank eddie for sending these out to me and yeah it feels really slick on the surface again it gives me carpro echo vibes look at that so pretty nice just to give you an idea how slick it is. So I think thanks for watching. I will catch you the next one. Go ahead and post down below. And again, take care everyone.